Hey everyone, this is Grace. I hope you've been well. Oh, don't mind my nails. I need to um, erase my nail polish. But anyway, I wanted to share with you entry number two to my birthday challenge. This is from Happily Ella After, Jeannie over in New York. And um, she sent me not only a pocket letter, um, but she sent me some goodies. So you certainly didn't have to, but thank you. I definitely appreciate it. And um, I'm going to pause this a little bit so that I can delve into this, open it um, with two hands, and then show you just um, her crafting style, certainly. I think, um, I don't know if I've told you guys, but even though I have stamps from way back when, I used to cross stitch, knit, crochet, and what have you, um, I still consider myself relatively a newbie crafter, and so um, whenever I watch some of you guys and your crafting, I'm just blown away. So, um, Jeannie's style of crafting is something that certainly I get blown away by. And, um, I think she die cut this and did you emboss it? I don't know, but it, it's this beautiful, um, happy birthday die cuts. So anyway, um, hold on just a minute and let me open it and then share with you her beautiful crafting style. All right, so um, this is what is left of her beautiful tag um, wrapping, and she actually made this tag for me to use, I believe, right? Maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But anyway, certainly um, I can reuse this. I think she made it. I mean, this is how her crafting skill is. I mean, it looks store-bought. <laughs> So anyway, um, I don't know if you guys noticed this or if I made a um, mention of it, but she used actually three different types of ribbon to wrap that up. And then, of course, her happy birthday die cut is there. And this is her beautiful pocket letter, you guys. So she opted for the home state, and I'm so excited to be able to receive a New York um, pocket letter from her. And um, I'm going to link down in the description bar um, her... Um, VR or her video response um, explaining um, she went through and explained what she did what she used and her thinking or inspiration behind all of these squares but now uh, you can see here her washi tape and I love this washi tape um, very New York and then um, we've got Times Square Central Park and then this beautiful Statue of Liberty and then just continuing on Coney Island. I love this. Don't even think of parking here. That's cute. My sister actually lived in New York um, City for a while. I think she lived um, in Midtown. And um, so because of that, I certainly got to visit New York um, more than I normally would have. Um, I visited New York, I think, twice while I was in college because I went to college in Boston, Boston area. And um, yeah, so it was just this is great. Thank you so much. I love the details that you put in here. Oh my goodness. And this is very apropos given the fireworks in the background, given our recent 4th of July celebration, huh? Anyway, um, and then in the back, she sent me these little goodies and I will, oh, that's cute. I'm going to read that letter, um, off camera. And then she sent me two tags. Oh, they're wooden tags and oh lots of little mason jar oh and then a anchor and oh I love this cupcake and these will definitely come in good use oh and then she sent me some of the Coney Island New York um, washi tape and birthday um, washi thank you so much and then these I will make good use of with embellishments and oh my gosh the sequin one is gorgeous oh and then she sent me some die cuts this is coming a little bit darker on video than it is in real life it's this very beautiful pale green oh did you see the messiness that's under my table <laughs> yeah Bentley's on my lap actually so all right um, and then these are the goodies that she sent so my goodness she showered me with goodies so these i oh wow i'm gonna have to think about how to incorporate these into future projects oh these wood are they wood veneers is that what you guys call them? these two were actually nicely tucked in here 
with this nice little balloon washi. I think not only is she a good crafter, but she's very good with presentation. Oh, and I love clocks. And so this rub-on will come in very handy. Ooh, 3D from 29. Oh, these are beautiful. Thank you, Jeannie. Oh, and then the cork stickers. Oh, nice. Oh my goodness, you have totally, wow, you have spoiled me. Thank you so much. Um, and I don't know if you guys remember from the previous clip, um, before I paused it, that all of this was tucked in here, and the cellophane bag says happy birthday. And then on the black, she taped it with, of course, the balloon washi, so... Anyway, thank you so much, Jeannie. Um, I'm going to enjoy using these, certainly. But I love especially the New York um, pocket letter you've sent me. This is certainly, um, it, it's great to have some of your favorite places. And I know that one of my other friends on YouTube is going to be making a New York pocket letter, I think. So I'm, I'm very excited to see what kind of things she decides to um, focus on and what her crafting style is like and things like that so anyway thank you so much and everyone thank you for those of you who are watching um this birthday um challenge series and ooing and awing with me um on just the creativity of these entries as they come in so anyway have a great week um and i will see you hopefully in a few days bye